Please know that God is here. He loves you from so many. And now we should remain face, hope, and love at the grace of Jesus' love. Saturday of May 2021. It's good to gather for the celebration of the two of you and that the rest of your lives to each other. We enter this gathering with a sense of joy as well as with a sense of soberness. We know that marriage is a difficult and a wonderful thing. It's not something to be entered into lately. It's your desire that this marriage lasts. This is a desire that is not yours alone. Your friends and family here today desire for this marriage to last. You, Kyle Albert Kohler, a crystal angry to be your wife. Will you love her and care for her no matter what circumstances may come your way? Will you honor her and sacrifice for her? Will you love her as Christ loved the church? I will. And will you, Crystal Ann Graham, take Kyle Albert Coleman to be your husband? Will you love him and care for him, no matter what the circumstances that come your way? Will you honor him and sacrifice for him? Will you submit to him as the church submits to Christ? I will. From this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, for as long as we both shall live. I am so very proud to marry you today. I promise to wipe away your tears with caring and compassion. Together, we will wipe clean the old canvases of our lives and let God, with his amazing talent, fill them with new color, harmony, and beauty. I love you more than the bad days ahead of us. I love you more than any obstacles that may come our way. I choose to be at the beginning and end of every day, secure in the knowledge that you will be my constant friend, my faithful partner in life. I will cherish you and hold you in the highest regards. These things I give to you today and all the days of my life. You complete me and make me a better person. I was a little late to be your first, but I want to always be your last. I will love you forever and always. <laughs> Crystal, you are my best friend, the love of my life, and the woman I want to wake up to every day and see at the end of each night. Although today marks the start to the rest of our lives, I know it will not be enough time with you. I will not take our time together for granted, and because words cannot say enough, I promise to cherish you, support, and love you. Be faithful, love, and I promise to show you for the rest of my life, how much I love you. I promise to encourage you to follow your dreams. I promise to make you laugh when you need it. I promise to encourage your passions too, and to nurture your dreams, because through them, your love for Christ, your love for mankind, always shines brightly in your soul. I promise to shoulder our challenges, for there is nothing we cannot face if we stand together. I promise to be your partner in all things, not possessing you, but working with you as part of the whole. Lastly, I promise to you my love, commitment, and trust. This is my sacred vow to you, my equal in all things, and from this day forward, you will not walk alone. I talk with my head on making sure the vows are serious, <laughs> and I you nail it. Because it comes down to the promises we make. And you've made some great promises to each other, right? No one's forcing you to do this to you a joyful desire to love. So well done. Um, rings. We have some rings, I believe. Okay. Let's go with yours first. Crystal, Crystal, I give you this ring. I give you this ring as a sign that I choose you. As a sign that I choose you. And I give myself to you. And I give myself to you forever. Forever. I gave you this ring. I gave you 
as a sign that I choose you. I give myself to you forever. Well, now that you, Kyle, you, Crystal, have made these promises to each other before God, these witnesses, and have exchanged rings by the power invested in me by God and by the law of the prophets of Alberta, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Therefore, this is the second one you can't say. Oh, man. Therefore, when God is going together, let no one separate. You may kiss your spouse. <laughs> we hold it together when they can. You would give them all the joy strength and energy they need to love and to surrender to each other, to fulfill the promises that they made to each other. Lord, they don't enter this life and you claim this in your holy name. We pray for your blessing on them. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Alright, well this time, I'd like to invite uh, Joel and May to come on up and we're going to sign your registry. Thank you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Kyle and Crystal Colbert. 